How's it going, everyone? Today we're going to do a quick little first of two competitions, if you will, uh, as far as what seems to be a better return. The uh, Panini Prism Draft Pick Basketball Cello Packs with 15 cards each, including three uh, red, white, and blue inserts, or a blaster box. Just a kind of quick comparison. Um, I'm also going to have another video coming up here in the not-too-distant future with... Uh, two blasters and two cellos. So we'll kind of have between the, the two videos, we'll have three blasters and five cellos to compare. So feel, please uh, let me know in the comments here whether or not you, which one you think won this battle. Uh, otherwise, please like, subscribe. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys more and then we'll get to break it after the intro. All right, so this is going to be my first basketball break. Marcus has done a couple of these this product in the past. Um, so we'll go ahead and get started here. We'll rip the cellos first. Actually, I might open all three of them. So you'll see in these packages, there's a 12 card, and then the three red, white, and blues are in their own package. We'll go ahead and get all three of these open at the same time. And that way we hit the cellos all at once. Issues there. I'm going to push it back here. So here we go. Let me go ahead and get some of this moved out of the way. So here are we that and that. So we'll go ahead and rip open the first of our 12 count cello packs. Again, I don't think there's any guarantee besides the three white and blue, red, white, and blues in that second package. Everything else is just going to be relatively base and a couple color. All right, kick things off with the Jaden McDaniels. We have a Crusade of Denny Abji, Isaac Okoro Base, Precious Achua, Devin Vassell, and Isaac Okoro Green, Killian Hayes Green, Devin Dotson, Zeke Naji, Crusade Obi Toppin, an Okungu Base, and an RJ Hampton Base. Uh, we'll do all of the bases first, and then we'll hit the red, white, and blues. Let's see what we pull from the second base. We have a Xavier Tillman. A Crusade Aaron Naismith. Ooh, Tyrese Halliburton base. Base Aaron Naismith. James Wiseman base. Xavier Tillman green. Oh, we have a... Prospect Autograph, Ryan Woolridge. It's my first auto that I pulled on a video. Green Ryan Woolridge Auto. We'll go ahead and get that sleeved up right away. Again, first autograph. Maybe not the rookie or the prospect that you would be targeting, but again, somebody else we can keep an eye on and kind of see what happens. But still, pretty awesome to get your first auto from a cello that we just got from the, from the store. Uh, Marcus Howard. Looks like we have a downtown card. Oh, no, it's just a, a crusade, it looks like. Tyler Bay. Global prospect, Killian Hayes. That's what it was. Presses to Chua. And a Killian Hayes base to finish that one off. All right, and then we're on to our last cello main pack of the, of the rip here, of the video. Let's see what we pull from this one. Grabbing a Theo Maladon. We have a Crusade James Wiseman, Cole Anthony base, Theo Maladon base, Xavier Tillman, a green Azabuki, ooh, a green LaMelo ball. That one's a real nice pull there. These cards really do feel great. Uh, Tyler Bay, Jordan Nora, Global Prospect James Wiseman, Tyrese Maxey base, and then a Sadiq Bay base. So again, just from our... Our bulk cards that we got there. I guess I should have put the, the auto here in this pile. But kind of our best insert slash hits were the Ryan Woolridge auto, Global Prospect James Wiseman, the Green Global Prospect Lamelo Ball, Crusade James Wiseman, Global Prospect Killian Hayes, Crusade Aaron Naismith, Crusade Obi Toppin, and Crusade Denny Abji. And with that, we'll head to the... I guess technically nine red, white, and blue cards that we get from this product. Uh, let's go ahead and get this first one ripped open. 
I think realistically the most sought after cards at this stage of the game are going to be the Lamellos. Ooh, I like that. There's a Tyrese in this one. Uh, Xavier Tillman, Isaiah Stewart, and then a red, white, and blue Crusade Tyrese Halliburton. I'm excited about that one. He's a fellow Wisconsin guy, so I do have some rooting interest in his success, regardless of if I had pulled any of his product or not. So it's nice that that worked out that way. Now let me go ahead and get this second red, white, and blue pack ripped open here, if I can. If not, we're going to go ahead and call in a little assistance. And with this one, we're going Cole Anthony, red, white, and blue. Theo Maladon, and Xavier Tillman. I've pulled a bunch of Xavier Tillman on this, just in these cellos. So it'll be interesting to see how he develops now that all of a sudden I have a rooting interest in Theo Maladon becoming a player. And speaking of the devil, there he is in the back. Now I'm going Isaac Okoro, Killian Hayes, and Theo Maladon. Um, it is interesting with these international pro prospects and the fact that Panini and and their prism doesn't have the the rights to put their jerseys on there so there's the interesting pulls there uh so yeah so there's there's the uh results from our cello packages again i think my favorite outside of the signature are going to be is going to be the red white and blue uh tyrese halberton um, so from there we're going to go ahead and launch right into the blaster so so far it's got a pretty pretty steep um challenge to overcome because again, I do really like those red, white, and blues. I think that they're, they're really sharp looking. Um, but we'll go into the, uh, into the blaster and just kind of a quick rundown of what you expect here. You get four cards per pack, seven packs. Um, here's kind of a rough breakdown of what we're looking for from that perspective. Um, just kind of some of the different inserts and things you can get. And here are the actual um, blaster exclusives that you can, you can find. Um, ideally, it'd be really nice to find a downtown card, and I thought that, I don't remember which one it was, but I thought we had one. I thought we'd gotten lucky, but unfortunately, it didn't work out that way. Actually, we can go ahead and move that. We'll put this here just so we kind of know what we're looking for in this, in this set. And we're going to move these back so you get a little better view of those. And again, we got four cards per pack of this blaster box. That will get things started. Kick things off with the Crusade, James Wiseman. Base, Cole Anthony. Ooh, a purple, Devin Dotson. I don't think, now I'll say, I wasn't sure if though, I didn't think that was numbered. I do not see a number. Now we have a base, Tyrese Maxey. Head to the next pack. Pull from this guy. Looks like Danny's going to be the last card. We have a Theo Maladon base. A green Patrick Williams. Sadiq Bey. And Denny Abji. Avija. Now, if I'm pronouncing it wrong, just correct me in the comments. Because, like I said, we have some more prism to rip in the future. And so I'd like to get it right going forward. Um, we're going with uh, Xavier Tillman here, Isaiah Stewart, a green Jameis Ramsey, and then a base Tyrese Halliburton. All right, push right on through here. Next pack starts with a Crusade Tyrese Halliburton. Then we go with a green Isaac Okoro Crusade. This is a Crusade pack. And then a base Crusade LaMelo Ball. And then a Kira Lewis Jr. base. Lots of base cards here. Um, again, with the a relatively smaller crop of prospects, they end up having a couple different variants of each prospect that kind of come through here. Um, let's see what we're able to pull here. Uh, Jalen Smith. Kira Lewis Jr., like I said. So here are the two. In the last two packs, we had two different variations of the same player. Um... I'm sure we've seen that here going forward, but these just happen to be run after the other. And we have another prospect autograph. This is pretty good. It looks like an Ashton Haggins from Kentucky. Let's take a look and see about this guy. We have a green Ashton Haggins autograph. Um, again, so this is the second autograph I've pulled out of this product, and I am not upset about it because these were literally, besides the hobby box I pulled, that guaranteed autos. These are the first autographs that I've pulled from products that didn't have a guarantee. 
Um, let's see here. So that's not a, that's a really nice pull there too. And then we finish off with the Casa Stanley base. And so we're down to two packs left out of this blaster box. Let's see what we're getting here. We have a Lamella Wall base. A Zeke Naji. Yeah, a green. Devin Dotson base. And then a Zeke Naji base. And then we're off to the final pack of this break. And we'll kind of go over a quick rundown. And honestly, I thought the cellos might come out in the front, given the fact that we found that auto in there. But the blaster coming through to match that one for one. Um, that, actually, I, I like Max or Hagens as a better player. Uh, so they might get the nod here. In the last pack, we have a Jade McDaniel, a Crusade Denny, a Crusade Precious Achua, and a Crusade Obi Toppin. So again, we'll kind of go over the cards that I deemed as kind of our hits across the board. An Ashton Hagen's auto, the Crusade James Wiseman, my favorite being the Crusade Red, White, and Blue Tyrese Halliburton, Killian Hayes, Theo Maladon Red, White, and Blue, two, two double, I didn't realize we had two that were different um, looks, the Cole Anthony Red, White, and Blue, the Ryan Woolridge autograph, James Wiseman Global Prospect, LaMelo Ball Green Global Prospect, James Wiseman Crusade, Killian Hayes, Aaron Naismith, Obi Toppin, and Denny. Um, and that is going to be our comparison between the two. Um, and again, let me know in the comments what you think, who, which, which product was the, the bigger hit, which one kind of delivered more as far as if you could choose to find two cellos versus one blaster box in the store, which one would you pick? Um, thanks for the video, guys. I had a great time. See you in the next one. Have a good one.